What's up, YouTube family? This is your boy, Rocky Wolf Gaming, coming to you guys with a little bit of a special sneak peek to Sons of the Forest. Um, it's actually not a sneak peek, it's actually a trailer. Um, I've seen the first two trailers, uh, the one that came out a year ago, and then the one that came out, I think, about six months ago. Um, both of them had some very interesting things going on. Um, different kind of mechanics for the new playthrough. I love the forest. It's a great game. It's a it's got a nice plot. There's a lot of building mechanics that I think are really cool. I can't wait to see if some of the mechanics I saw in trailer one and trailer two actually are in this game. So we're gonna look at trailer three um, of the game that's gonna be coming out very soon. I believe May twentieth of this year. Very, very excited. Uh, in game, uh, in night is uh, awesome, awesome. Or what they've been doing, um, it's really good developers. Uh, it's a great game. If you've not played it, go check it out. So, we're gonna switch screens and we're gonna get right into it and see what you guys think. Let's go and not do that. <laughs> Keep forgetting to turn that off when I switch screens. All right, so this is the developer in night. Let's get into it. Sons of the tra uh, Forest trailer three. Let's go. <laughs> that always scares me. <laughs> okay, I got a lot. Or let's talk about it. May 20th. All right, let's go back here. Um, so first thing, a couple things about this trailer that I got to talk about. There's a lot of mechanics that I'm looking I'm hoping they have it in the game. Number one, this game looks super amazing compared to um, the original Forest. Just the, and I get it. Trailers are meant to be uh, draw you into the game, but I'm hoping that the mechanics are the same. Check out the butterfly on the top of the shotgun. <laughs> what the heck? Uh, so then we got the, that. Then you had you saw the deer kind of running through there where the bushes were moving around as they went through. Great mechanics. So far, I'm loving it. Butterfly goes away. And, you know, I feel like the butterfly is like a warning symbol of something that may happen. I don't know. We'll see. Then this mechanic here, right here, at the beginning of this... So this is a little bit different. It looks like um, you have some form of lighter like you have in the other. In uh, the original Forest, you had like a little Bic lighter looking thing. This kind of looks like it, but you need, looks like you need uh, leaf or something to start it like you do in the original Forest. So, and uh, the fire is set up a little different too. And this is interesting. I'm wondering if this is how you start the game. Because right here, do you see right here? It looks like a little, like uh, maybe a, a raft or something. Uh, you know those red uh, survival la rafts? I'm thinking that could be it. And then, I'll show you the next one here. So this right here looks a lot different. 
the actual crafting table is so much different than the forest was. Um, number one is there looks like this looks like a GPS from the I think it was on the number two trailer. There was a, a GPS that looked just like that that you can track where you're going in the forest. Um, this I'm not sure what that is. Maybe a compass of some sort. Um, maybe this is the lighter. There's the axe. That's the knife. I'm assuming he's making a, a spear of some sort. I'm going with that. I love the mechanics though with the knife. This that this is really. I hope it's like that in the game. Um, I will have to say the turtles look a lot better in this than they do in uh, the actual forest. Really great, as you can see, all the different parts of the turtle. Uh, even the 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 tape that he has around there for the uh, spear. Very cool. So I think this is one of the mechanics that you'll be able to eat raw meat uh, without cooking it. Because that's he's eating raw meat right now. So this is interesting. And it looks like, uh, you know, you got a couple of these guys. The seagulls are eating their brains. <laughs> kind of love this. This is kind of cool. This is the one that's very interesting to me. So in the couple trailers I've seen this, this scene here with this girl. There's got to be a storyline about this, me, us helping this lady. We don't know. I don't know too much. Of, I don't want to speculate. But something goes on. She helps us because we're going to see in the scene here. Yeah. Did you guys catch that right here? Hold on a second. Let me see if I can go back just a little bit more. See if I can catch it. Ah, just barely. Yeah. Hanging on by the tree? That's a new mechanic that I've not seen in the forest. Where they're hanging out by the tree just kind of looking. Oh, that's going to be so creepy. You're going in the forest and there he is just watching you. Kind of like, you know, that face right there. Oh, God. It's so freaky because you're walking. You're trying to look at the eye level of the forest. You're not looking at them being on the ground like this. Uh, most of the time you can hear them. They scream and, uh, yeah. I don't know. This is going to be interesting. They climb. This is really cool, um, them climbing on the ground like that. Uh, it's going to be an interesting way to do battle now. A little bit different. Um, I don't know. We'll see. And again, do you, can you catch them on fire? Can you put all the bodies and then get bones from them? I'm assuming that mechanic is still around. We'll see if that works out. Cool flashlight, though. Uh, the flashlight is pretty cool. The bats are still around. What the hell is this? Why do you have to put a shark? They're, they're already dangerous enough. I don't need another element of danger. And why is there floaty things in here? And why there's no sun in here? Why would you be in here? <laughs> a shark. A damn shark. That is so creepy now. Okay, this is another one. So this is the same uh, platform we saw in the beginning of the, of the game. You guys remember the crafting table? I love the way this is looking. So much better than the actual forest uh, crafting table. It looks like you got some food here, some meal kits. Looks like some food you're going to cook. Looks, there's your power bars right there. Look at the ammo. Shotgun shells, taser. Uh, and then this looks like maybe some 9 mil. There's the circuit board, some flares. There's the explosives. Uh, that looks like Molotov. There's the explosives with the watches. You know what I mean? This is really cool. I'm loving what I'm seeing here. Uh, so much more than, uh, than the last one. And the fact that he's using, his, you can see the hands and he's putting it together. It's so cool. Yeah, the electrical bat baton, I can't wait to try it out when it comes out. I'm totally going to use it. Okay, so in trailer one, there's this gold, the gold face uh, thing that he has. And then there's that red face. And then this face here that he's holding up, 
obviously has a significance to something. What that is, I don't know. Obviously, he killed this person, so this, uh, this scares them enough to where they back off. So he puts it on a stake, and he's like, yeah, this is my spot. Now, this is pretty awesome. The mechanics to make this pointy so that when people come up or cross the wall, because we'll see it here in a minute, if you don't have that, they can now go over your wall. Holy shit, that was not something that they could do in the forest. Pretty excited though. See, look. Boom. Boom. All right. Let me see if I can go back just a little bit. That. There she is right there. <laughs> She's got a shotgun and a gun. Uh, obviously, we we help her and she helps us. So it's a win-win. Uh, I'm pretty excited. I don't know what this is all about, but I'm pretty jazzed that uh, we have the opportunity to do this. Then you got these guys. See, look, they just climbed right over the wall. No big deal. This cat here. Holy shit. He's about as tall as a... And then you have this. Hollow Springs, an exclusive luxury bunker community. Uh, contact for prices. Customize your own today. Ask us a... a you know... You got a broken plane, and you got this little thing here. Why do we always have to crash in this game? We either, the boat gets damaged, and we have to go to an island, a plane crashes. You know, we're always in a crash in all these survival games. Can they come up with a different thing? Like, I don't know, maybe we were, we were blindfolded and just dropped off on an island. <laughs> we got kidnapped and thrown on an island. Uh, but anyway, this is interesting. So, uh, Hollow Springs, an exclusive luxury bunker community. There's a storyline behind that. Look! Look, it's the flying babies! <laughs> Get down, son! So, this looks like the bunker, right? Because, uh, oops, sorry, let me go back to it. Kill this before we were done. So, let's see if I can get to, I think it said right there. There it is. May 20th, uh, 2022. But let me see if I could go back to this scene here. So, this looks like an underground bunker. It looks like this is overgrown grass and stuff like that. Um, very cool anime. I don't know who this cat is. Uh, he said son. So, I'm assuming that's dad and that's son. Um, and I don't know who the guy that's laying on the ground. I have no idea. Because obviously he's watching this. See? Sons of the Forest! Very cool. Alright guys. Uh, May 20th. That's the that's the joy of when it's coming out. Um, pretty cool. I'm pretty excited to see what they're going to do with the game come May 20th. Oh my god. I can't wait to play it. I'm looking forward to it. I'm going to do a complete series of that because I really love that game. It is something that you guys need to go check out. Uh, if you want to go check out the, the trailer, the link for this one will be down at the bottom so you guys can go check it out if you want to re-see it. Um, I will try to put trailer one and two as well so you guys can see all three of them. And you can see the progression of how each one of the different trailers and how they've added a few extra things here and there. The mechanics, I'm looking forward to it because it looks pretty cool. I don't know if it's going to be that way when we play the game, but OMG if it is. So um, hopefully you guys are enjoying this, uh, this little bit of uh, review with the Sons of the Forest. Uh, basically, it's the Forest 2, <laughs> but it's called the Sons of the Forest. I'm looking forward to it. We'll catch you guys next time. This is your boy, Rocky Wolf Gaming, and as we say here, let's game. Peace, y'all.